Target. Welcome to Target, y'all. All right, y'all, so we came in here to specifically get ingredients to make a plant-based spaghetti and get on out of here, so let's see how that goes. All right, so I know I want bell peppers, but I wanted green. I ain't got no green bell peppers. Well, they do, but they're not organic, I think. No, they don't. No green. Well, I guess I'll go with these. But the green is really what give it that flavor. Okay, so I know I want to use some of this plant-based ground beef, but I already have a box at home, so I don't think I need another one. So we're gonna put that back and just use the one we got at home. And that is, ooh, pricey, $7.99 for one pack. Let's see if we can find some decent spaghetti sauce from Target. Um, yeah, this is not the owl I want. What I think I'm gonna do is just let this basket sit here and then come back and put the stuff in that I need. Cause pushing that basket is some work. No spaghetti sauce on that aisle. All right, we on the aisle with the spaghetti sauce. So let's see if we can find a spaghetti sauce that has decent ingredients. Um, let's see, we got Tomato, basil, and garlic. Let's see what the ingredients looking like. Tomato puree. I'm trying to put it so y'all can see it. But it's blurry. Tomato puree, diced tomatoes, juice, and tomato juice. Vegetable oil, that's not good. Cotton seed, canola, soybean. Dehydrated garlic, dehydrated parsley slices, natural flavor. That could be better. Okay, let's check out this one. Roasted garlic and pasta sauce. Let's see what these ingredients looking like. Organic tomato puree, tomato paste, citric acid, diced tomatoes, roasted garlic, virgin olive oil. Yeah, see this? The ingredients in this is much better. I mean, it might be, I don't really care too much for the citric acid, but I don't know if you can avoid that with using tomatoes. But yeah, this is pretty clean, so. I'm gonna go with this. And I guess I'll get two of the same. Let's go find our cart, y'all. And then we're gonna try to see if we can find some good pasta. Some clean and some clean pasta. Okay, y'all. So now we're gonna see if we can find some pasta that has clean ingredients or the cleanest that Target probably has. So here is the pasta. So let's see what we got here. Thin spaghetti. Regular spaghetti right here. It's regular thin. All right, let's check out the ingredients on this spaghetti. So this spaghetti, yeah, see this, 
it has the what is that so so semolina wheat but then it has the added um it has the added i guess vitamins and that's what i don't want because that means they stripped out the natural nutrients and added them back in and we don't want that So let's see if we can find something cleaner. Okay, let's check out this Barilla brand and see what they hit info. All right, so y'all see the ingredients in that. The ingredients, it's just the uh, semolina wheat and durum wheat flour. Oh, dog. I was just about to get happy, but looks like they do have added vitamins. And that's not what I want. All right, we ain't gonna give up just yet. Let's see here. All right, we got... Probably need to look at this one. This is whole wheat organic thin spaghetti. Now, I'm going to be disappointed if this one got added minerals. So, okay, this is what we're looking for right here. Nice, clean ingredients. So, y'all, excuse the ashy hands, but where ingredients are, you see, all you see is organic, whole, durum, wheat flour. You don't see no added minerals or vitamins, and that's what you want. So, we're going to go with this. onion also so let's go find an onion I don't know if Target got organic onions or not but I just want one onion not a bag just one onion that's all I need just one onion I want to make me a cucumber salad so we're gonna get us one cucumber uh. one cucumber is this organic no it's not are these organic Well, I prefer organic, but they don't have organic, so we're gonna go with this one. Make me a nice cucumber salad. We got this loaf of bread right here we're gonna throw in there that my daughter grabbed for me. And this is one of my favorite butters that I like to get from Target or Whole Foods. So since we're in here, I might as well go and grab some. They don't have green bell peppers. They only have red and yellow. So should I use that or just go without? Cause I feel like if I use red and yellow, it's gonna give it a different vibe. So it's something else that I like to get out of Target. It's, it's not related to my spaghetti, but since we in here, I might as well grab some. These right here, I like these little bouchette what is it? Bruschettini? 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 I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna grab one of these strawberry olipops. The strawberry. I should get some clean bread from over here and make my own garlic bread. What you think? I might make my garlic bread using these bagels. 
for my spaghetti. But I hate to even come down this aisle because I know I'm going to see some stuff that I want. Like this right here. That Amy's Organic Black Bean Burger. And it, the ingredients is probably clean. Let me see. That's a lot of ingredients to read, but... Well, the tofu is not good for you. Soy protein not good for you. But to be a plant-based burger, I mean, if I was going to try one, I would stick with something like this. But again, it's not the the healthiest. But I'm going to try it one day. It's just not today. We're going to look for some garlic bread. We're going to stay focused. We're going to get our spaghetti ingredients. And we're going to get out of here. Now, ain't no garlic bread on this aisle. You want the cheese or the garlic? Okay, so. I'm gonna get this for them. They want the Texas Toast 5 cheese. All right, y'all. So, let's see. Did we get everything we need to make a plant-based spaghetti? All right, we got the spaghetti noodles. We got two jars of pasta sauce. We got our garlic bread for the kids. We're gonna be using um, this to make my garlic bread. We got butter. We got garlic at home. We got an onion. We could we couldn't find the green bell peppers, but we might just do without, or we might stop somewhere else and get the green bell peppers. And um, we got our plant-based ground beef already at home so i think we we got the job done i got my olipop as well this one right here is calling me though the orange they got these poppies right here let me see that's grape raspberry rose oh i wonder how that one tastes two for i mean three for six you want to get two other flavors and we just try them together all right we're gonna try this raspberry rose and this this orange 